So it's going to be... everyone hi here we are again we want to give you an update on how things are going mm -hmm. and we have some exciting news for you yeah as you know our last trip ended in a bit of a dissolution yeah I don't feel well the new life not having work anymore not being able to meet with friends the disappointment of the properties. I have a non-functioning thyroid, which makes life extremely difficult. But I'm holding up against all odds. These days we are keeping a bit to ourselves. Maggie is not feeling well and I have a hard time trying to understand her anxiousness, fears and doubts. For more than 100 days, we explored the Adriatic coast, searching for a second house with Sea View. Which we didn't find. Because there were a number of issues that popped up in our journey. We never got enough time to work on a good relationship with the real estate agents. We were too hasty to really get good results. We should have stayed put more often. Also. We didn't really thoroughly thought through what it is that we really wanted. We just didn't have a clear image. And on top of that, as the season progressed, so did the number of camper folks. We had a hard time finding quiet and free spots, and sometimes paid the grand price. This led to stress. So we decided to stop searching for a moment and recalibrate. So we went back to Amsterdam. Yep. We had a lot of good talks mm -hmm. and we decided on the following. Narrow down our search. Not too hot, not too cold. Near to Melijn in Rijeka, mm -hmm. not too far from Holland from Pepijn, not in Greece and not in Croatia. So it's going to be... Italy! Italy. Well, this has a number of advantages. We speak a little bit of Italian. We have a good friend in Italy. And we had a nice time in Liguria. So, we are going to look for a house over there. We are already searching through the houses, using the housing sites. And we have a number of options. Idealista, which is the number one real estate portal in Italy. There is Green Acres. Green Acres! It's the best portal for second houses in Europe. There's Gateway. And that's nice because it allows you to search specifically for farmhouses and unusual properties. There is Casa.it and Immobiliari.it. Now, as it so happens, we have also found a Dutch-speaking representative, so she will help us in our search. Buying a house in Italy is different from buying a house in Holland. Mm -hmm. A house in Italy can be sold by several agents for different prices. Looking. We are looking at the category obsolete mm -hmm. old farmhouses that need renovation, with some land not far from the sea. We hope we can find that in our budget. Yeah, probably we'll, we will be able to find it in our budget. So, beginning September, we will schedule appointments with the agents. We are making a list of all the houses we want to look at, and we are preparing a mind map for us and for you that will keep track of our proceedings. We will pin all the possible houses on the new map. 
with push pins and checklists and mood maps and other things that we like and basically anything that pops up and we want to remember. In September we will begin our second trip. We will of course film everything and our new season will start probably September 4th. Yep. Till then. Bye. Bye.